Hello, this is Caravan Salon in Dusseldorf, the largest RV show in the world. I'm now going to show you a van from Rapido, French company. This one I'm going to show you today is a uh, seven meter, well, under seven meters, 694 centimeters long. It's this one here. It has got uh, single beds at the back, which are joinable and uh, let's have a look at it here it's got some details 694 by 235 by 289 three and a half ton basis it costs 75,110 kickoff is 69,000 6,000 of extras and engine upgrade it's got a rapid up pack select series 8 which includes this stuff here which has uh, the the radio with the reversing camera you've got cruise control actually for cruise control it's quite not particularly expensive when you uh, <laughs> compared to what you normally end up paying uh, for these things oh but they even got a mosquito uh mosquito net you'd expect that to be sort of included here i'll show you I'll show you that there you go i think that should be in the in the price anyway never mind Yeah, stick the stick the lights on. So it's integrated van, uh, which offers all that sp up the space up front. Table, relative. Actually, it looks large because of the. Uh, it probably looks larger than it is in this camera. The reason for that is because uh, it's my it's my mobile phone, Samsung S7. So that gives you a bit of an idea of what it's like in its uh, when you're sitting down in my favourite seat. Oh, I'll put my legs up there. You go. Put my legs. Look, the wa the weather's changed. I've got to got to wear long trousers. 5th of September, last last week, right, end of August, it was 32 degrees, absolutely roasting. But anyway, the temperature's dropped since. Anyway, good, uh, kitchen. And some of their vans, they only do two, um, two burners, something in the camper vans, I mean the high-end stuff. But you know, I think I've, I have used three, but extremely rarely. So, if you want to shut off the bedroom. Uh, from the people sleeping in here, you do it like that. Alternatively, if you want, you can also shut off the bedroom from the people in here by doing this somehow. Something like that. Sorry, it's difficult to do with one, one hand. There you go. Well, oh, I'll show you this. Unfortunately, you know, it's, it's a bit difficult with this camera. It's not even the camera, it's a telephone. Right, so you've got this this enclosed area, which, sorry, this, but even if I had my, had my normal camera, it wouldn't be. You need, a, you need one of these panoramic things. There you go, so this is enclosed now. You know, bear in mind this this van is under seven meters in length. Does that give you an idea? Oops. 
sorry. I appreciate it's going to be easy if you've got two hands, but all the same. It's a bit unwieldy. I think the idea is uh, okay, I think. I think it needs a bit more work yet. Yeah? I think it's a good idea to have a storage locker that position in the bed. You've got your feet down here. So you may as well use the space. It's not a huge amount of space under under these locks though for your head. Of course it's a it is a van, so uh you know, you've got to make some uh adjustments. Um, the floor here, I've got to point, this isn't the normal floor, this is just here for protection, right? So that, that's that's your normal floor. I'm going to put this up here to, uh, for, for you know, people who are walking in and out to protect it. So that's, yeah, it isn't broken or anything coming off. Right, well you can fill this bit in here using these things. And uh, there's that, and there's that. It goes down here. Oh, you've got a uh, up there. You've got a skylight. Only it's got light. It's got lights in it now, which is understandable. It's in a hole. Bed, are you going to bang your head? You most certainly are. You're going to have to duck as you come out. Also possibly, possible without the bed uh, above. Makes sense. Uh, extra storage and you don't have to bang your head personally I prefer it when the uh, doors are the same size at both ends there, the, in the Rapido, the garage has a maximum weight of 150 kilos. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's, like, it's even written down there. I warn you, do not overload rear axle when loading this space. Oh, and that's made it quite clear that you've got to actually load it over the entire amount. It's, it's, Yeah, I'll show you one or two of the vans. You also get this one without the uh, bed over the, uh, the cabin. This is what it looks like before anybody actually comes in here. Now, why have I filmed so many Rapido vans? Am I, have I done a deal with Rapido? And the answer is, well, Rapido, I can get on the stand. And oh, I see now that the Carrado stand is open, which is down there. It wasn't open when I came in here. Uh, 
when I started doing the, the, the Rapido vans. Um, Rapido is still owned by the same family. Uh, it started it off, uh, there was a party here last night and they were there, so it's nice for them to uh, sort of hang out with, uh, with us, so to speak. I think the, uh, the father's about to hand the business over to the son, that's what I understand anyway. I don't know them personally. Um, in fact, I, I mean, I, I even had somebody told me that's, that's who it is over there. But had uh, Rapido not left um, it open, then it would have been very, you know, I'd have gone somewhere else. So when I do anything like this, first of all, I ask people what vans they want to see. I then um, try and film them. But, but, but if I've got something like this, I can get in and I can actually film the things. I've got a bit of material to show people. So that's... Uh, that's how that's how it works. You see now, okay. So the Cartago van, the Cartago stands uh, becoming open. Uh, this is a French company called Florette don't see many of their, their vans on the road. This thing here, style van, I've never seen them before, but clearly a, um, it's Florette's version. Florette's cheap version. Everybody seems to want to do it. I wonder how long it will be before Morello brings out a camper van. I think I might mention that to them. Okay, so, um, I hope that was interesting and if it was then please do subscribe and uh, thanks for watching. <laughs>